Hey everybody, this is Chris from Friendly Moke America of Detroit, and today we are taking a look at our first moke in an in-depth, deep dive going over all the features, what can be customized, and what everything does so that you can be comfortable driving around in your brand new moke. Let's start with the front end. All right guys, here at the front of the vehicle with the moke, we do have standard headlights, turn signals, running lights, um, and the beautiful thing is that your push bar, your grill, the actual color of the vehicle can all be customized individually. So you can really make this thing stand out and look unique just to you. Um, let's move on towards the interior so we can go over a couple different other things um, that come standard and a couple options that this, this one here is actually equipped with. Guys, here in the interior of the Moke, first and foremost, this particular one is gonna be equipped with the wood grain steering wheel. It's beautiful, it's very nice to get your hand on. Um, they do come standard with the backup camera as well. Um, speaking of backup camera, um, they do have a typical shifter like you would find in your car. It's a beautiful thing to see. Uh, parking brakes, just gonna be like your normal parking brake that you'd see, just pull the lever. Um, this one is going to be equipped with a radio, so you have these nice big speakers as well as tweeters in the corner. Um, as well as that, we have the canopy top on this particular one. This is an optional extra. Um, and then we also have the, the roll bar. So when we were talking about the customization on the grill and the push bar up front, the roll bar is also customizable in color, separate from the body actually, um, in terms of paint. Um, back seat space, we have tons of space back here. I still actually can't even reach the back seat. Um, so plenty of leg room. Um, very easy to have four people, even five people in here if you need to get everybody around. Now let's go to the back of the vehicle so I can showcase a few extra things and then we'll wrap everything up. All right guys, at the back of the Moak here, we do have the spare tire, um, always nice to see full size spare. Um, we do have the backup camera back here as well, as well as that additional push bar, some mud flaps, brake lights, turn signals. Now the unique thing is there is a spot for a plate. Um, so this can be street legal. Uh, it does depend on your town um, if they allow vehicles such as these to drive on the road, but you can register it and plate it. Um, with that being said, if you guys do have more questions about customizing a moat um, or wanting to order one, uh, use the link in the description or give us a call. Um, also, if you're curious about more tech specs, uh, we do have another video uh, going over the technical specifications on the moat, such as charging time, battery life, um, the type of suspension this uses. Um, and that's a little bit more information. If you guys want to deep dive into that, um, you can check out that video as well. Have a great day and we look forward to hearing from you.